he did win. There you go. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Excellent. Is that first frame or that like... That was his first set, I do believe, the day. Oh. That's his first set win of the day as well, so shout sure. out to Stokens. Coming out Well, his first players. set in Waterfall. Like yeah. yeah. But, uh, oh, no. He's oh. late, John. We've got our, our stream man. So we got the man of melee. Rage. We got, we got the, the D20 die master. Who's he going to play today? Looking spiffy. He usually kind of randoms it up or does whatever he feels like. Mm -hmm. Luigi, okay. Okay. All I right, like his Luigi, right, so actually. This guy's from Central, right? Who is he? Uh, broccoli? Broccoli uh, from town. Oh, shit. That's, oh, that's, that's broccoli? Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. I did not recognize him at all without the broccoli sweater. That's fair. That's fair. He, he has, has had that sweater, sweater on every time I've seen him. He it. doesn't have it now. <laughs> I do not. I'm so Can, sorry, Is he dude. even broccoli if he doesn't have the sweater on? I mean, his hair kind of looks like the head of broccoli. It's true. It's true. Need some ranch dip with that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's actually a little gross. Yep. Uh, Didn't realize how that came out there. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. It, things I, happen. I, actually, I don't like ranch, to be honest. I don't like, no? I don't like ranch dip. Some people eat ranch with pizza. I love pizza. broccoli. Ranch with pizza. How do you feel about that? Because I think it's gross. I've heard about that. Uh, I've heard about it. I don't I feel like that's it. the next level of pineapple on pizza. I do like pineapple on pizza though. Okay, but well, I we're not friends anymore. I don't make well, well. No, no, just, just no. We, we just. Are right, you guys? We, we, it's been nice. Uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Uh, no we, we be friends. We just. Uh, let's, let's, we just can't get pizza. Let's avoid that conversation topic. Just, yeah, just no. All right, so we got game one going to FOD here. Um, not a bad stage for Falco at all. Uh, yes, it interrupts some of his laser game, but he can get those double dares so quick through the low platforms. Yeah, this th and this is a good stage for Luigi in a lot of matchups, just because the variant he can work on almost all the platform heights. Yeah. Um, but honestly, considering how weak Luigi is to, to dare shine pressure, you can't really do anything to dare shine pressure. So like, yeah. I kind of feel like this might be a bad stage in this matchup for that reason. However. The walls will make it a lot easier from the wall tech. It's true. It is true. It's like this is the first things coming to mind. That's a wall tech person. He doesn't really have to worry about uh, the vertical KO. The only thing that he's gonna really get KO'd from off the top here is he probably down tilt. Uh, that or uh, yeah, because there's no shine up, no shine fire firebird. No, not on Luigi. And like I, I, I wouldn't expect like an up like a up B on a platform read. Oh, oh. yeah, like Lu Luigi doesn't really KO off the top. Against spaces or fastballs no. very often, so it's usually sides with down airs or forwards. Yeah. Matches is what I see. So Ray is trying to play like fairly mind game, just like walking up, mm -hmm. not wave dashing much. Yeah, oh, it just it. runs right in and grabs. Wow. Oh, -esque. that that was very good. What he did there, the dash attack, good spot. Dodge. Oh, he clanked with the shine and runs of vulnerability. With Rage the is just making all the decisions. Oh, he gets a uh, he gets screwed up by the lasers there. Probably uh, backing off and using the gun, trying to control that space. Rage is playing for a very long time, so although he's not always a very technical player, he does have a good few fundamentals. And, Absolutely. And he has a good line games too, so like, sometimes you can take any character and you can just open one up on you real quick. I think if Rage picked a character and stuck to it, he'd be... he'd get really good really fast. Well, yeah, but then he just wouldn't be Rage. Yeah, then he wouldn't be Rage, that's the thing. Yeah. So he didn't, he didn't get a wall tech there. On the down smash, but I mean he's only like half a stop behind. Oh, gets the gets the read there, but uh, just a little early. Yeah. Didn't wait for the tech roll. Good down smash, no he, conversion. Though. He's making decent use of crouch cancel there. Oh, there it is again. Yep. Yeah, at this rate, a, a couple more and down smash will kill. Actually, I'm pretty sure. Falco's a fast faller, but he's also fairly light, so. Ooh, there's one missing. He has canceled oh, it. Oh my goodness. Uh, there's okay. rage. The guy. Yo, yo, clearly un unintentional, but a huge bonus when it happens. Absolutely. Uh, I think Luigi players that the ones that like always like, they get a bunch of intentional misfire or green missile edge cancels. Mm -hmm. They're nuts. I I don't understand. Do you, like, like especially with the misfire. How do you? How do? You, oh my god. Number one, you have to predict you're gonna get the misfire. Number two, you've got to space the misfire, well, you which can, I don't understand the distance. Well, you can option coverage. You, you can do it at the distance, and if it happens just to be a regular green missile, then you can just keep going. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, you don't really have to predict it, but just for a regular green missile, but that's fine. Uh, oh, starting to get something started. Yeah, so, we're just to, trying to make a comeback here. That upside is not going to KO on FOD. That ceiling's very That hot. back air will, though. Yeah. A little, uh, little too long on the charge on that side B there from Rage. Yeah. Ooh, 
that was Pretty really cool. dangerous to get up in place there. That could have been just another F throw, and mm -hmm. that's trouble then. Rage isn't oh, going for any conversions up his up throws. I'd like to see some up airs come out, maybe some nares. You know, uh, I set a lot up for Luigi. You know, uh, up throw, up tilt, into like, you know, nair fair, nair dare. Like, there's, there's, there's definitely some good combos, but like, you know, maybe, maybe he, you know, he always random his characters, so like maybe he doesn't know the, the matchup. It's a combo game. I haven't seen many nairs come out from him. A nair with Luigi is just super good. Yeah, he's been kind of staying on the ground and not. He's doing mostly space and back airs, so yeah, he hasn't really been doing the, uh, nares. What's he gonna do here? I was thinking down, I was thinking down angle to F-tilt, but... Mm. He honestly could've just, like, ran off and dared. Fast fall dared. Yeah. But, um, that's not what he's going for. Oh, and there's the nair. Yes, yeah. That's what we like to see. Yes, yeah, the drop cancel nair. Oh, shield poke. That's gonna kill, yeah. I'm really You know, I'm kind of thinking, like, maybe Broccoli tried to do something out of shield there, because, like, that, it's honestly... It's a big hitbox, and it should have hit the shield. I mean, his shield wasn't that small, so, yeah, no. I, fi I figured that that it would have hit the shield first, but... First nair. Let's see if we can get the edge guard here. Stab. No. Rage with a good, good recovery there. Trying Covering a, the, the ledge with the forward air. And trying to put up a wall back here, but Rage manages to slip into that weak reverse hitbox. Ooh. Are we going to see the comeback? Oh, he's, he's, trying, he's trying to speed it up a little bit. Yeah. I don't like the uh, the dash attack there from Rage, though. Oh, he got back. Good sweet spot. He needs to just grab the ledge. Oh, oh too risky. Too risky. He taunted. Broccoli taunted. I don't, I, don't, I don't know how I feel about taunting. I feel like taunting against Rage is like kind of like why you're doing it. Like I feel like it's a moot point. Like, you bet somebody that is playing a random character. And you taunt. And, like, sometimes kind of this fools around. That bags, like. Well, I mean. Some people taunt for different reasons. Some te people taunt to be just mean. Some people do it because they just have it do it at the end of the match. Who knows? Like, I honestly. I don't pop off very much, but I pop off before I taunt. Yeah, I, I don't taunt ever in game, really. I rarely do it. Only against someone I'm friends with, just as a joke. That's yeah. That's usually what happens, but uh, I will pop off. I, I, I still don't even, like, oh man. Rage is gain, and I've actually seen this a couple times, and it is not terrible. Yeah, he's, uh, he, he, play, he can play some Ganon in PM, too. Yeah, definitely knows how to do it. Oh, good already, stomp. Made, already making great use of jab and stomp. Two bread and butter tools. I think he has more knowledge of this kid than Luigi's. Yes, definitely. Oh my goodness. See, see that? He knows, how to, he knows how to do the double jump fast fall. Edge guards yeah. for Firefox and Firebird. I'm seeing him try to do some wave lands on the platforms too, so I think he's more familiar with the movement as well. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 play, I play with Rage fairly often, like yeah, outside of the tournaments. And like, Ganon is definitely one of his more knowledgeable characters. Oh man, that was an up smash. Oh, he could have done a charge up smash there. Holy crap. Still getting a lot of percent here, and just wizard kick. That's gonna kill. Yeah, wow. just intelligently knows that Broccoli's been approaching with nares and dares, and that wizard can, wizard foot can literally just trade with it. Or, yep, worst case scenario. He's getting everything he wants here. Every time Broccoli's yeah, he'll, trying to come back. Yeah, he's having he's having platform moving to get get rid of those uh, grounded lasers. If you're not doing the, the full jump triple lasers, then it's like then it's uh, with platforms and good wavelengths, Ganon can actually approach fairly decently. It's very important. You need to you need to keep the platforms locked down too when he goes there. So Reed said he's just gonna get up shield there, but missed uh, missed time and missed space yeah. to the up B, unfortunately. Like, as Gan as a Ganon player, you always want to like do some try. You always feel like you want to do something when they're doing shine dare pressure because you feel like you should punish that. Yeah, but it's it's so hard with such a long jump squat to do it with Ganon. Yeah. When I play this matchup, I just oh is that lasers and nares on oh, wow. it. Broccoli with it. That was a quick game, not even two minutes long. Rage taking that in convincing fashion. Yeah, and even besides the fact that Rage might be a little more familiar with Ganon, uh, like if you if you're spacey and you don't know how to play against Ganon, and he takes you to like something like Yoshi's or FOD, then you can yeah you can die really quick. Just yeah. The wrong DI when you don't know that he's gonna fare, and you're just you're you're dead. Especially poor little Falco. I mean, you just. Gets off stage once, and if you get hit out of your up B, you're pretty much dead. Just a little bird. Just a little bird that can't even fly. Oh, Blue Jay. Oh, no, that's not what he is. I don't know what he is. He's a... He's, he's fa okay, Rage is far. He's a falcon. What? He's a falcon. Okay, yeah. Um, Could be a hawk. 
Never know. I don't, I don't know the difference, honestly, but... Okay, so... I know Rage can actually play some Fox seasonally. Like, he, like he's he's pretty good at Shine Spiking. So, Broccoli going back to the, uh, the Sheik. This is what I originally thought Broccoli played. Uh, I, I, I was kind of surprised to I see the Falco. he played, like, Peach or something. Like, I, I just hadn't seen him play, even though he's been around. He's a Zelda player in PM. Okay. Uh, but... So Peach would kind of make sense because although they're very different, the, the floatiness, the floatiness same, I guess. and the movement, like the, the speed of the movement, could be similar. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. They're not really similar. At all, the and he's getting uh, getting poofed on there. Yep. Oof. Doesn't get the forward air there. This is rage. Um, side B's a lot. In Fox. I've played as Fox before, and I find he just does side B in neutral as an approach. Yeah, at least sometimes he just doesn't mix up. He does that a lot with a lot of different characters. He has a uh, oh good down tilt there. Yeah, down tilt is actually is actually like half safe on shield because it actually pushes away a fair bit. If you space it, it's fantastic. Yes, it's it's actually it's longer than Matt's grab. Fox down tilt is longer than Matt's grab. Yeah. It, out, it outranges it. It gets, it's super good in the math matchup. Not many people know, they understand like, exactly just how long mm. Fox Down Tilt is. It's huge. It is. I know it's kind oh. of Yeah. Dead for that. Good back air there to clean it up from Broccoli, though. Pretty lucky Phantom from Broccoli because if, if Rage got more started up on that stock, it could have been a hard comeback to make. Oh, yeah, there it is. Yep. So, what do you think about the Dreamland pick? Broccoli, uh, um, one of that survivability for Sheik? Okay, so they picked Dreamland and Rage went Rage ran and Fox. No, I guess you didn't want to get Shine Spikes. I mean, it can still happen though. But like, you know, yeah, it's a bit harder for Sheik, especially where he doesn't play Fox that much. You know, he's less likely to go out there and Shine Spike Sheik. It's difficult. It's, 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 hard, hard, it's, it's one of the hard. You gotta have more experience to be comfortable with that. Like, I know some Sheiks like like Dreamland a lot, uh, but like, I feel like. I feel like the Falco matchup is just better though. In a way. Yeah, uh, I love the Fox Falco matchup. Yeah. As Falco, I absolutely love it because you get one shine, you can convert so hard. Yeah, that's why, like, if it were me, I would have stayed Falco. Yeah. I, I agree with that as well. Yeah. Making it back there. Kind of, I don't fair that Flubby he really needs to clean up the stock before he loses his, honestly. That'll make it a lot, okay, there we go, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Broccoli. If, if Broccoli got the lead and then maybe got some gravy on the top, then that could have been a really hard comeback. Yeah, it, it's really demoralizing to me, and I know to a lot of players, when you're down in percent, and, sorry, when you have high percent, and you don't get that kill, it's like, I'm just yeah, they're, they're a high. They they kill you, but they're a high percent, and they end up doing a, like a a really clutch zero to death on you. Yeah, and it's just like wow, I just they just gained a huge lead from what was a small lead. It's actually like it's pretty devastating. Yeah, you've you've got to keep your composure. There's I was thinking needles there, but yeah. I see he was reading jump, just jumping oh, straight to ledge. I love that up tilt there, down air into instant up tilt. Yeah. So as soon as Broccoli tried to come out of shield and I guess an air just got. Oh, we got right some up. tech chases. Oh, uh, not there though. Yeah, yeah, for the wake up shine. If you don't have so really good react, yeah, if you don't have a really good reaction time, getting uh, grabbing the wake up shine is really difficult. Unless you like space yourself beforehand. The one thing I'd like to see Rage doing a lot more differently here is number one, up airing that uh, dash attack that he got, and number two, stop giving Broccoli the ledge for free. Yeah. I think there were a couple times you go to up smash, I guarantee you did yeah. Or I'll throw up air. Okay, now it's even. Even get stocks. He's not get beat three. up during this vulnerability too much. Okay, he's done that. So he's avoided that. Broccoli just opting for the needle charge, it looks like. That was not a good trade. 3% for 18%. No, he, uh, he lost that one, but got the grabs <laughs> afterwards, so we'll see what he can do. Yeah. No conversions off the up throws. So up air and air are pretty free there for Fox. Yeah. So that was a bit of a re up smash. I don't know what he's looking for over there. Up smash fair, I guess, but her killed. That down air would have hit if he didn't fast fall. Yeah. Now that them are really falling for their crouch cancel tricks right now. Ooh, oh. Oh. oh, the down tilt there was really good. Yeah. Oh, good forward smash. Edge guard opportunity. Oh, oh, he did it! 
No! Oh, just, oh, he's just got to grab the ledge. He's got to stop giving him the ledge. For yeah, there's a chance why he just turn around and jump. Yep. Would have been over. Oh, good oh, air, I guess actually. It's... Oh. Goes for it again. Starting to uh, starting to threaten that shine a lot It looked more. like he walked forward first. I think he missed his run first. Oh, oh dude, you got to grab the ledge. Oh, why? Oh, he got the rabbit jab. Oh, no. I don't oh, think he meant to do so that. Spaghetti. Oh, oh, the up tilt's going to wow. take it. Yep. Rage wins 2-1. Uh, I'll be back in a minute. I need to get a drink. Absolutely. Yeah. Congratulations to Rage. Takes that 2-1 in a very, very close set there. On stream, can I get the Puerto Rican Rival State versus the Phoenix? So we've got Puerto